So you might be asked to calculate the transmitter power output using the indirect method. So what is the indirect method? Well, it's you have to take two parameters that you measure from the transmitter. One of them is the plate voltage. The other one's the plate current. You'd measure these on your remote control. And you got something called the efficiency factor, which is what the manufacturer specifies for the transmitter. So this is gonna be a figure that's just given to you by the station. Say, hey, you use you know, 0.85 or whatever. That's just an example. Could be anywhere from, say, mid 70s to high 80s. So it'll be plate voltage <clears throat> times plate current. I'm going to use the initial I for that. Times efficiency equals the transmitter power output. Okay, so as an example, say 6,000. And these are just random figures I'm pulling out. It could be way different than this, but the math is exactly the same. Times, uh, say, 2.2 times uh, 0.85. So that's all there is. Plate voltage times plate current times efficiency is transmitter power output. That's called the indirect method. <laughs>